Hey, this is Supreet and welcome back. So, uh, I'm in the middle of immigration process and uh, I keep meeting a lot of people who are even trying to immigrate like me. And I keep interacting with uh, many people who are also applying for immigration and, you know, I try to uh, keep interacting with them. You know, I try to share my knowledge and, you know, I try to gain knowledge from them. And the basic query which I received and the most frequent query which I received was, do we need a representative or uh, do we need a consultant consultancy uh, to you know uh, make your process easier or to apply for immigration on your behalf now uh, in my opinion i would say no you don't really need an, uh, you know, a consultant or a representative um, because you know uh, express entry profile is a straightforward approach and if you go through their website each and every process, each and every you know, uh, steps uh, for uh, the process is being explained uh, so that you know uh, you can apply it yourself. Um, but the problem is uh, you will have to spend a little more time. You will have to do a lot of research. Uh, research in the sense you will have to go through a lot of information in their website and uh, you know uh, apply for your immigration process. Now, uh, if you ask my experience, you know, I have consulted uh, a lot of uh, consultancy and the only response I got was, uh, we would like to evaluate your process, I'm, I'm sorry, we would like to evaluate your profile and uh, see if, you know, uh, you are eligible to uh, you know, carry on with your immigration process. So, uh, what they told was, we would like to, you know, uh, check your uh, language proficiency uh, we would like to check your skill sets your education background and then come up with an analysis analysis and uh, uh, you know try to uh, tell you convey you you know whether you are eligible or not now i thought uh, let me check you know if i can do it myself uh, just because you know uh, they would be charging an additional amount for this uh, for their analysis uh, so I thought, hold on, uh, let me, you know, uh, try to uh, make some more research, uh, go through CIC website and, you know, we'll come back to you. Now, what I found was you have a CRS calculator tool uh, readily available by CIC website. Uh, so now you don't have to rely on anyone else. So you can, you know, try to uh, key in all your information and calculate your, you know, projected CRS score. So uh, you can you know keep an eye on cicnews.com uh, so that you will be getting enough information on you know uh, the recent draws uh, which has happened uh, during the month uh, the current month and <clears throat> you can you know tally or match up with uh, your projected score or your actual score. If you ask me you know uh, life is all about uh, do it yourself strategies right. So uh, it just requires a little amount of time, little amount of research and uh, consultant would unnecessarily charging you hefty amount uh, for the knowledge which you already have gained uh, for the process which you have already you know aware of now my only problem with them is they are charging unnecessarily uh, a hefty amount and uh, in in my perspective if you have a special case which you are not able to do it yourself um, so in that case, probably it's good enough to you know um, consult uh, consult a uh, you know, representative uh, and see if you know they settle down to a negotiable you know, amount. Um, otherwise, I mean uh, you're good to do it yourself. And you know uh, express entry profile creation, or uh, if you're going for a provincial nomination program, uh, it is not that complicated and you will have to study a little bit on you know the eligibility criteria if you are applying through provincial nomination program you will, uh, every province has a different um, you know eligibility criteria and you will have to study a little on their point grid system how is it calculated and how your points can be matched to them and whether you are eligible or not so this is one more point and you'll have to you know be aware of what are all the required documents to be uh, used or uploaded uh, when you create your uh, express entry profile and in case if you receive an ITA. So uh, these 
uh, all information can be found in CIC website that is uh, cic.gc.ca now you can also you know join uh, whatsapp groups facebook groups uh, or you can also join uh, you know the discussion forums like canadavisa.com where you will have ample of uh, information which helps you you know uh, gain this uh, the basic knowledge about uh, you know creation of express entry profile or you know uh, finding out your eligibility uh, so now uh, the basic level of research at least should have uh, should be done and uh, in case uh, if you find that you know you really can't do it yourself and you really need a help of representative make sure that you know you are asking good amount of questions to uh, your uh, uh, you know, potential representative and uh, they answer you well and uh, you find it satisfactory and make sure uh, these are you know registered member of IRCC uh, they will have a registry a registered license um, uh, so that you know you are uh, seeking the help of an authentic uh, consultant so with that note you know I would be ending this video and if you really find uh, any you know useful information you can comment me uh, in the comment section